Hey, kindergarten, today is Tuesday. It is May 12th and it is time for sound work. All right, let's go ahead and get started with our rhyme. Today's rhyme is O. So thinking about words that end in O, like row, low, show, slow, no, Bo. I have a friend named Bo. Can you think of any other words that rhyme with O? All right, are you ready? Here we go, beginning sound. Basic, basic, b. Oval, oval, o. Each, each, e. Weather, weather, w. Interest, interest, i. Eraser, eraser, e. Nice job. Say the sounds, blend them together. Here we go. P, e, g, peg. W, ache, wake. H, o, l, hole. M, it, mit. J, u, n, june. K, a, f, cuff. D, e, p, deep. R, ace, race. N, u, t, newt. S, Eyes, size. Nice job. All right, let's do our middle sounds, riding that roller coaster around our loop, isolating that middle sound. Here we go. Lime, 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 I. Seam, 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 e. Tip, tip, t, ip, i, i, i. Tuck, tuck. Uck, uh, 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 boat, boat, b boat, o, mop, mop, m op, ah, 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 paid, paid, p aid, a. All right, get your choppers ready. Here we go. Ready? Loom, loom, l, u, m, tide. Tide, t, i, d, dab, dab, d, ab, wrote, wrote, r, o, t, case, case, k, a, s, big, big, b, i, g, meal, meal, m, e, l, tube, tube, t, u, b, Vine, vine, v i n. Puff, puff, p a f. Good job. All right. I'm going to give you the rhyme. We're going to put on an onset or a beginning and we'll see what the word is. Here we go. M, m add h, him. Oat, oat add v, vote. Ite, ite add t, tight. Ache, ache add l, lake. Et, at a j jet. All right, now we're gonna take that first sound or that onset off and see what's left. Here we go. File, file without f is aisle. Sun, sun without s is un. Tin, tin without t is in. Heel, heel without h is eel. Pave, pave without p is ave. Now we're gonna change that onset, change that first sound and go from one word to a different word. Here we are, are you ready? Time, time, change t to r, rhyme. Save, save, change s to g, gave. Road, road, change r to t, toad. Meal, meal, change m to d, deal. Could, could, change k to w, would. Excellent job. All right, now we're going to go through our letters, just our letter names, and then we'll go through with just our sounds. So don't forget, we've got a new digraph in there, W and H. W and H says, wah, wah. all right, here we go. I'm going to mix them up for you a little bit so you don't remember from yesterday. Here we go. Ready? Just the letter names first. F, H, P, B, V, U, O, W, 
L I Z M A E D W H T C C H S Y G Q N J T H R K X S H. Now we're going to go through with sounds. You guys are getting fast at these. Here we go. Ready? Uh, uh, uh. Second sound, U. Ah, ah, ah. Second sound, O. Wuh, wuh, wuh. Second sound, I. Zzz. Mmm. Ah, ah, ah. Second sound, A. Eh, eh, eh. Second sound, E. D, d, d. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can also say E or I. G, g, g. Second sound, j, j, j. Qua, qua, qua. Mmm. J, j, j. K, k, k. K, s. The beginning of a word, it might say z. Nice job. Okay, we have been talking about using strategies to figure out words that we don't know, and we've been talking a lot about looking for parts that you know. So one thing that we talked about was when you have a C and a K together, they make the k, k, k sound, like in the name J -a -k Jack. Yesterday, we talked about a different part. We talked about these three letters and when they go together. I-L-L -L says ill. If we put J at the beginning, it says J ill, okay? So this is like when we do in our sound work and we say we know the ending, ill, put J on the front, Jill, okay? So there we've got Jill. If we take off the J and put on a, it becomes the word hill. And those are some of the words that were in our poem yesterday. Okay, so today we're gonna look at two more words. Okay, and both of these have parts that we know or we're gonna learn. Okay, I want you to look carefully at this word and see if there are any parts that you know in this word. I see two letters. We do these letters every day. This C and H say, so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to say the sounds and blend them together, remembering that this part only makes one sound. Okay, you ready? Go. Etch. Ooh, that's a lot of sounds. Let's do it again. Ready? Go. Fetch. Fetch. That's the word fetch. Fetch. To fetch something means to go get it. So for instance, you might play fetch with your dog. You might throw a ball for your dog and your dog is going to go fetch it or go retrieve it and maybe bring it back. So if you go fetch something, you're going to go get it. Okay. So Jack and Jill are going to fetch something in our rhyme today. So you know that CH says, Ch, we looked for a part we knew. Here's a pair that you might not know. Maybe we've gone over this, but I can't remember. Okay, ready? These two letters. When this vowel team is together, this A and I, they make a long A sound. So they only make one sound. The A and the I work together to make the long A sound. So when you see this, it says A, okay? Here we go, ready? Say the sounds, blend them together. P A L. Ale, 
pail. A pail is kind of like a bucket. So they're going to fetch a pail of something. Okay, so Jack and Jill are going up a hill. They're going to fetch a pail of, let's see if you remember what that word is. All right, here we go. Got to move all my, I have so many letters out today. All right, here we go. So first thing, I want you to see if you can find the word pale. Pale. Yeah, it's in our new line right here, that A and I, that vowel team, when they're together, they make that A sound, pale. Let's see if you can find the word fetch. Fetch. Here it is right here, fetch, fetch. All right, let's say our poem. Here we go. Jack and Jill. Jack and Jill went up the hill to fetch a pail of... I'm going to try to say the sounds and blend them together. Water. 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 Sort of sounds like a word I know. I think I'm going to go back and start again, see if I can get a running start. Here we go. Ready? To fetch a pail of water. That sounds a lot like the word water. Let's read it and see if it makes sense. Jack and Jill. Jack and Jill went up the hill to fetch a pail of water. That does make sense. We figured that out by getting a running start, going back and starting again. Great sound work today, kindergarten. See you tomorrow.